Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Many tried to reach Jericho. Few succeed. Humans have little pity for our kind. And you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. If you could decipher the signs, it's because one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. This place will make me free. Find Jericho! I understand how you feel. But we have more freedom here than you ever did. I came to Jericho looking for hope. Looks like I'm not gonna find any here. You're lost. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. You're safe here. You can stay with us as long as you want. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Shape, am I? My diagnostic program isn't working. <laughs> I don't think it would have anything good to say anyway. What happened to you? They tied me to the back of a car. I think they wanted to have fun. I don't want to shut down. No, I, I don't want to shut down. Humans are afraid of dying, too. Do you know what happens after death? No. No, I don't. Well, I'm about to find out. What's your name? Marcus. Glad to meet you, Marcus. They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. 
They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They won't. We're slowly dying out. How long have you been here? Four weeks, three days, eleven hours. When I escaped, there was nowhere else to go. Jericho seemed as good a place as any. A lot of these guys in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. I'll never accept what we are. What was your function before coming here? What do you care? If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. Are you Lucy? Sit down. Show me. I'll stop the bleeding.
Drink this. Give me your hand. You had it all. And you lost it all. You've seen hell and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife Warehouse is in the Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Maybe it's worth a try. Okay. I'm in. Be okay? We'll get some help here. Soon this will all be just a bad memory. This is the place. Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Come in. Come on in. Don't be shy. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, don't be afraid of our big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this 
big empty old house. Please, make yourselves at home. How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he said you could help us. I see. Deviant, huh? What about her? She's human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's... That's exactly what we want. Of course. Well, I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Come on. Follow me. Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Of course. Right this way? Everything we need is in the basement. I don't like this place. And that man. Let's go, I have a bad feeling. Please excuse the mess. I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. This way, please. If you could just stand over there. I should warn you, this could be quite unpleasant. You know what's strange? For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviance. That's why it's so hard to find them. So, actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said that... Yeah, uh, people believe what they want. You deviants are so naive. They all come to me expecting me to help them. And I just reset them, sell them on. 
or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No! I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! I forgot about the child. Um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That's, that's so sweet. And so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. what you get for having a dream. It always ends up the same way. Tears and disillusionment. Believe me, you're better off being erased and feeling nothing. No more pain. No more hopes dashed. I almost envy you. Kara! <laughs> Oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like Mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like Mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, <laughs> what happened to you? Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. <laughs> you bit me. I'm gonna teach you some manners, you little bitch. Meet me in the living room.
you must remember who you are. Otherwise, the little one will die. Yourselves at home. Master's dinner's ready. Take it up to him. Yes, Luther. Just set it down on the table over there. Get rid of that carcass. Uh, take it next door. Please look off the word. Fucking whore walked out on me from a fucking accountant! Did you hear what I said? Yes, Lacko. Luther! Luther!
Yes, Laco. I should be done here in ten minutes or so. I'll have a look at the little one, see what I can do with it. Understood, Slako. I'll bring you the little one in ten minutes. Sorry about the little one. Residents were disturbed by a surprising chase through the city streets this morning. According
Kara, you remember me. How could I forget you? I'm so sorry. You were right. We never should have come here. We have to go. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? Luther! Yes, Zako. I'm finished here. Go fetch the little one. Right away, Zako. I warned you, dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. What are you doing? Get out of my way. No, not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. What are you doing? Who let you out? Get away from me! Get away from me! Obey me! I'm your master! I'm your master! I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. Finally, I could see. 
I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. I could take you there. I could protect you. You and the little one. All right. I trust you. <laughs>